La 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 Libra Libra come into the CV like Hello Libra Oh that's not where it goes. Okay. Anyway, hello Libra <laughs> Welcome to your mid-November to October read of this current fucking year. Libra, this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. I almost forgot the word rising. Like, Jesus Christ. Uh, so if this resonates with you, good deal. If not, do not worry about it. It's just a card game. Just boop your nose and away it goes. Right? No stressing, of course. Dudes, guess what? My fucking neighbor came back. And he's sober now. And I got to hang out with the dog for like half a day. And I was fucking super excited because it was just like, oh, I miss the dog more than I miss this motherfucker. Sweet. You know, but he looks a lot better. But I feel like he's been through a, a great deal of shit. But we found out that he had been paying rent on the place the entire time. So that's kind of cool. At least he's doing a lot better. He's not as crazy as he was last time. And that's the important thing, you know. Because, like, Libra, you guys go through so much fucking bullshit. And it's like... How do you guys handle that? Like, that's a lot of mental stress. Sorry, I've been day drinking, so I need to drink water as I go along. Oh yeah, newcomers. If you want a personal read, it's in the uh, description box below after all the music listings, right? First readings on the house, and I do accept tips and donations. Thank you very kindly. But yeah, I'm, re I'm really happy that he's okay. Like that that was more important than me. I don't I don't care what he does or how it happens to him. As long as he's okay, that's the important thing. So, you got the energy of the hangman, some Pisces energy. And the situation calls for the Queen of Wands, could be Leo Sag Aries. The wants and wishes. Um who wants to be a little bit abusive in this situation, Libra? Cause this is like my abuse card. Like someone takes it way too far. Like the kid knocked over some soda, and and mom just started cracking them, and she didn't stop. And all of a sudden, there's like crazy stuff everywhere, like blood and shit. It's like someone who took the abuse too far. So the fresh hell, Libra. Like shit, did someone do that to you? Possibly, because I would say that this is the actual main person right here when it's reversed. Your obstacle and challenge is getting something started, probably trying to work with people, whatnot. You might feel like comfortable in your own skin, but you know you're still a novice when it comes to dealing with people. Uh, your fears and rejections, though, is letting something go fully, which I feel like you don't know how to. And what brings this shit full circle, how it starts, how it'll end, is a happy family picture. With the beginning theme being insecurities to the point of death. Four of pentacles reverse. Some of y'all are like freaking out and just having freak outs and such, right? Did I write down Virgos? Yeah, I did. Okay, cool. I just want to make sure because that's how it goes. Anyway. Libra, you are at a crossroads. And your obstacle is trying to deal with this in a very sociable fashion. But I feel like you're rejecting the idea of just walking away from this bullshit. Just being like, you know what? Nah. And that's connected over here to this beginning theme. Just like this one. It's just like, I'm happy, but I'm sick of this shit. You know? Like, it's it's like you're holding on for no fucking reason. Like, you, like, you could easily leave this situation if you wanted to, I think. But I don't know. We'll just have to continue. Mind you, cross watch or switch where you need to, because I have no idea what the hell's going on. Right? Right. I just tell the story. After all. So this hanged man over here, you know, they're at a y'all might be at a crossroads, Libra and cross watchers, of course. Um, where it could be a Leo that makes you feel really, 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 really fucking uncomfortable. You know? Just in that and it's like you don't even want to explore shit with them anymore right jesus you know like i mean this shit did work back in the day but it's like continuing forward is a disaster and here's the knight of wands so it could easily be this leo again who's just causing some issues right here based on their own illusions of insecurity that they refuse to face uh, turning their back on anything other than the fact that like they want to get away with shit and then feel like they are triumphant and be pretty much like an asshole to you or not give you the credit that's due to you page of pentacles down here um this guy's probably an asshole i'm just saying 
Queen of Wands in the situation. Someone wants to sit pretty and not wait for something that they know. Libra, you might not even be waiting for something you know is what it is. We have a fear of rejection of letting something go, and that's based on the insecurities as well. So, Yep. Yep. Okay. Well, <laughs> I love when my cards just, like, agree with me and be like, yeah, you damn right it's the fucking insecurities. Look at them. They're all exposed and such, you know? Like, that's what they're really saying. Libra, it's just like, you already know. Or this is uh, a fire sign, possibly Leo, you're dealing with, who, um... You're recognizing that there's nothing worth waiting on them for. Like, they look good. They look really good. But, they're, uh, but their crotch is like a fucking desert. And every time it blows, you get shit in your eye, you know? Or every time they fight, like, if baby powder comes out their, bo their booty hole and just, like, leaves dust trails everywhere, you know? It's like you're recognizing that this person has nothing to offer you. And there's no point in waiting for somebody like that. Mm. Thank you, cold ass water. That feels so good. Sorry about that. I just needed a drink. I'm like sitting with the heated ray on my booty. And it's delicious. Anyway. Five of Cups reverse. Someone's a little bit abusive and I don't know why that's a wants and a wish. But I think somebody wants something to do with this bitch. Not this fellow right here. That might be the person who's actually like looking at the perspective. Right? Motherfucker, I had to crawl and get scarred up and messed up and fucked up, but I found two dogs and they helped me get the fuck out of these damn woods where you did not. You know. And there's no point in me even engaging with you right now. There's no point. That's how you're feeling, Libra. Um, this person, like, abused you, I feel like, or, or, or just made you feel fucking small. You know? Drop one more. And you, you're just not fighting for this shit. It's just like, what the fuck is the point of this? You know, um, bye, Felicia, I'm out. <laughs> like, you aren't even putting up a fight. You just throw the swords at him like, oh, okay, I have the option of fighting or leaving. Here we go. Here you go. Goodbyes. Goodbyes. All right, Page of Pentacles. You might be running out of patience. Or, uh, not patient. Patience with the temperance card. Sagittarius's card, right? You're probably running out of patience and probably getting pissed off. Because you're trying your best to be nice. And it's not, I, I feel like it's not working the way you want it to. And it's getting you really, really irritated. Or someone's losing patience with you. Possibly an earth sign. Ugh. Fucking hair. I'm calming it down because it's cold in my house and I need the extra floof. <laughs> Let's see. What else with this? Someone's definitely impatient with how they're dealing with shit. And they're deciding, you know, like, I just throw you in the lake of fucking fire and not feel bad about it at all, man. Like, I'm tired of this shit. I've been nice. I've been trying to do this shit, you know? And it's taking forever for it to get done. Hmm. Libra, I'm telling you. If you're, um, if you are entertaining people who you really don't click with, just for the sake of, you know, coming together, that shit's not working anymore. It's like you're changing or you're evolving or something. It's like they no longer fit your persona. They no longer fit your purpose. And it's just like, you know, you're at this point where you're like condemning them. And it's just like, man, it's going to be a really hard time not having any friends since all these people get on my nerves, you know? Ugh. Fears and rejections, right? You don't want to walk away from this shit. But you're definitely not getting any good social stuff about it either. Possibly from a king of pentacles. This is... Okay, so you might be dealing with an earth sign somewhere too. But, um... You're having a hard time walking away from somebody who possibly treated you like shit. And doesn't feel like investing in you. Ugh. Oh, God damn it. I don't know where my phone is. Shit. Anyway, but yeah, it's like, um... It's like, like, it's King of Pentacles. Like, sometimes when he's reversed, it's like, um... He could be a liar. He could be an asshole. He could be somebody who doesn't want to provide. And he's giving a nasty attitude. But I almost feel like he thinks that he owed something, too. Like, something belongs to him. Hmm. 
Hmm. That's very interesting, Libra. Like, I don't know who he is for the most part. Like, the Page of Pentacles, yeah, it's down here or whatever. But it's like also up here and it has something to do with this King of Pentacles. It's almost like you're really shocked someone didn't come back and be like, what up, bitch? How you doing today? Look at you. Look at you. With your shit, little nose and shit. You know, it's almost like you're... I'm dropping one more because I'm not sure. Because that one's like reading weird for me. Because someone thought they had control over them or domination or they're taking autonomy of their own body. Hmm. Like someone's got the ball in their court almost. Be like, you want some? Come get some, motherfucker. You know. You might feel like this person might have something over you, Libra, and I don't know what that is. Huh. All right. What goes around comes around. What brings this full circle, this cycle? The Ten of Cups. Uh, everybody plays the fool sometimes. There's no exception to the rule. Lest you lose your mind. Oh, shit. <laughs> I feel... Oh, God. Libra, do you feel like someone, like, was playing with your hearts... With, with what makes you... Mm. Well, I'll tell you right now, um, this happy ending right here, I almost feel like it's based on lives because one person is entertaining shit and the other person's almost bitter about it. Or maybe they're the same person and they're mad at being the fool or whatever, right? Especially since this has been like some sort of relationship that's been in the dark for a really long fucking time or something about it, right? Let's see. Ending theme. These changes are going to cause a lot of disaster, and someone's going to react poorly to that, Libra. Clarifying. Okay. So the energy up top, right? Someone wants to go the fuck back home with the Six of Cups, but it's like they're expecting other people to fight so they can figure out which one they're going home with. Which is like, why don't you just take the blindfold off and, like, pick one? Why are you making people fight to the death to figure out who we... Well, I guess that's, like, important, yeah. Like, do you love me? Or are you gonna fight for me? Yes, baby. Good, there's a sword. You can go kill this per... What? Wait, wait, wait. When did we decide to do this, you know? <laughs> oh, I need to close that one, girl. Ugh. I always feel like it gets cold when windows are exposed and I'm really thinking about like putting plastic on my windows this year just to keep the indoors a little bit warmer. Ugh, I hate being cold. Like I used to, did, I never minded being cold when I was younger but I guess that was my stupidity because now it just hits me to the bone and it's like ugh. Or I'm getting sick again and then I'm going to be pissed because I keep getting sick and it's like please stop. Okay. So this Queen of Wands down the situation. Someone might have walked away making her want more. She's a thirsty bitch. She's just like, I can't I can't believe that they like, you walked away from me. I thought it left me. The mimima. And that feels like it is not fair. Libra, whoever this person is, they think it's not fair that you walked away after they don't give you shit. Which is dumb. You know, their wants and wishes? Well, they picked options that weren't good, and that's probably why you ran away in the first fucking place. You know, none of this shit was complete for the witch's circle. You know, people kept coming up, like, dissuading you from, like, swinging your sword of truth to figure out what the fuck's going on. Everyone just wanted you to set, like, a nice pet, and that shit wasn't fucking happening because you, because people were expecting a lot from you. More than what you could, and you decided, you know what, I don't need a second round of, like, you know, like, what the hell is up? I'm just gonna go ahead and take this first tower hit and accept it for what the fuck it is. You know? There might have been a choice and bad options here, either on your part or somebody else's, Libra. 
But it's important to look at that and be like, oh, it's just a fish. Don't get upset just because there's a fish in your cup. Everyone gets a fish in their cup at some point. But don't let it overwhelm you because that's not the important thing. The important thing is you're getting the fish out the cup. That's what everyone should be focusing on, you know? At least that's how I feel about it anyway. But that's just me. I don't know, I'm Aquarius Moon too, so that's probably why I'm saying shit too, so don't mind me. Anyway, so let's see. Obstacle and challenge, Libra. Yeah, this shit isn't getting buried the way it's supposed to. And you're trying to be excessively gentle in that regard too. You're trying to stop yourself from making a hasty judgment to cut somebody in order to save that butterfly. Which is like, huh, Libra's a little butterfly. Look at you fly. All pre and shit. Putting the third one down. But someone needs to let go of this shit. Here's death again. And then here's this bitch, this Bruja, just dragging somebody into their own fucking misery. Like, someone needs to let go of this shit, man. This is what, like, the third time? Like, I mean, if it makes you insecure, it's not yours for sure, you know? Like, someone, I think, doesn't want to let go of you because they like your gentle nature. But that's starting to really piss you off, too, because it's just like, motherfucker, I will stab you if I have to. I just don't want to kill this butterfly. This butterfly is precious, and it, it marks my femininity. Uh, I am a delicate, feminine fucking flower, and you will remember that, you know? It, it, it's, like, it's like that. It's just like someone's taking your kindness for weakness, and it's starting to get to you. you know. Fear and rejection, right? Someone might be trying to rest up, and someone might come for a visit, but that's just to treat them like they're fucking numb. Not in a bad way, but to be like, here, I got this for you. Um, almost looking at you like you're just a little person who can't do the same capabilities as a regular human fucking being. But it's like they only want to come when you're trying to take a break, Libra. And then it's just like, here, I got this pentacle for you. How's that? And it's like, you motherfucker. Like, you treat me like shit any other time, but when you want to give me stuff, you always stiff me. And then act like it's a cool thing to do. I feel like this person stiffs you a lot and acts like they're doing you a favor by it. Which is annoying for sure. That my hubby. Alright, what brings this shit full circle in this cycle? Hmm. Well, someone's just gonna slam their fish on the freaking sand before throwing it in the water. Or pull a Jason and just slam it against the tree and be like, Fuck this fish! I'd rather have trash! You know, at least the trash can knows where it fucking goes. I don't have to put it in its place. Right now I gotta put a bitch in her place. Ugh. Because you're holding strong to your roots and your morality and your ethics. You're not doing this shit anymore, Libra. You are done with whoever it is, I feel like, who keeps giving you shit. But I can't tell if there's some sort of connection here that's keeping you from not being able to close the door. Because it's like you're recognizing that this, that this person's kind of a trash panda. But the problem is, is that uh, it's like you aren't able to release them completely. I don't know, almost like you have a kid with them or something, right? But, Libra, that's your reading. Yes. So... If you guys enjoyed this, please like, share, and subscribe. I would greatly appreciate it, of course. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Uh, no pressure, of course. But I love your guys' faces, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.